Meghan Markle accused of wearing microphone to Queen's memorial, secretly filming mourners for Netflix reality show. She's used this opportunity to compile footage for her upcoming Netflix documentary series. Apparently, some nut jobs think they spotted evidence of a microphone pack beneath Meghan's dress, and that's all the evidence they needed to launch this thoroughly asinine theory. Is Meghan Markle wearing a mic to use the Queen's death for her Netflix reality show? One tweeted. I can't believe she is recording this. She is just a violent toxic woman. I hope King Charles has told Harry she is not to come to the funeral, another added. I'm finally done. Meghan wearing a mic was my last straw, a third raving maniac chimed in. Royal fans have swung back at claims that Meghan Markle was the only person to cry at the Queen's funeral. Images showing the Duchess of Sussex shedding a tear have been circulating widely online and have caused some to claim she was one of the few members of the family to show proper dignity. Eagle-eyed fans of the family have, however, pointed to a number of other snaps grabbed from the day of the Queen's funeral, September 19, which show claims there wasn't a wet eye in the house were unfounded. Twitter user at Sussex Detective posted on the site that they believed Meghan had been the only one to well up. Above a picture of the Duchess stabbing a wet cheek they wrote, Meghan being the only one who cried for the Queen. Sums up everything really. Meghan Markle gets backlash for crying at the Queen's funeral. Royal fans wonder if this is a Netflix shot for her. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle made a rare royal appearance at the funeral, with Harry walking behind his grandmother's casket. Meghan stood with Kate Middleton, Princess Charlotte, and Prince George ahead of the ceremony. The solemn affair seemed to make Markle emotional, as she was photographed with a tear running down her face at the funeral. In another shot, she seems to wipe her face as she stands next to Sophie, the Countess of Wessex, though her funeral hat blocks the view of her face. Netizens say, I don't believe her crocodile tears. Meghan Markle wiped away tears with her black gloved hands as Her Majesty's coffin was taken from London, however, a body language expert has called into question her tears by saying it's hard to tell if she was feeling genuine sadness. Several members of the royal family were seen tearing up during the Queen's funeral service, Meghan Markle was no exception as she stood beside her husband Prince Harry at Westminster Abbey. Body language expert Adrian Carter, of the face whisperer questioned whether Meghan's tears were legitimate, something which has been hotly contested on social media. Ms Carter said, it's hard to tell if the tears are genuine sadness but Meghan certainly knows that tears would be spotted and photographed. We don't see much muscle movement in Meghan's face in the photo which would be activated with genuine emotional expressions. Meghan Markle made major headlines, when she and Prince Harry got married. Four years ago, Meghan and Prince Harry were all of the talk. As a mixed-race black woman, Markle was the first person of African descent to marry into the royal family. In addition, she had her background as an American actress. Meghan Markle was not a traditional royal, by any means. There are a lot of traditions that come with being a part of the royal family. In the end, Meghan Markle was not willing to bend for all of them.